hello everyone and welcome to my bed. Thank you, Dracul, for the bed. Uh -huh. <laughs> Just remember not to crack any blankets. Hey now. And I'm also joined by Wiseman today. Hi Wiseman. Hello. So this is me. A fun little gravity bed that Dracul came up with in a rather large joint ship we all built together. Hey, hey, your broadcasting's off. I see you out there. That's not. That's not. It's not. I'm flashing you. <laughs> he's, he's flashing me. I'm blind. To make me spawn one of Mike's drones in. He's showing me oh. the blueprint. Yeah, I've got a hey, blueprint. Hey, 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 hey. I'm watching a movie. Shh. <laughs> it's not a movie, that's a porn. There's a difference. Hey, hey. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Oh, you know what? No, 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 no. You go back there. You, you gotta, you gotta show. Oop. You gotta show off your um. Show YouTube your trick. <laughs> yeah. Let, let's see your your dirty pervness. Whoop. Uh, uh, almost, almost. <laughs> Quickly, activate the guillotine. <laughs> That's it. I'm gonna trap him in. Why? Didn't turn the guillotine. Why didn't you use the guillotine? <laughs> okay, so. This was, as I said, a joint build between all of us, and this is just one of the four arms on this ship. This is more like the uh, the crew area. The two cinemas that Wiseman put in. The yeah, bed that Dracul put in. <laughs> yeah. It took ages to properly convey this thing because of the odd shape about it. Uh, it has 12 reactors, a jump drive. All, all hail the almighty gravity generator. <laughs> okay, so... Praise the gravity <laughs> Originally, I put it on the ground. I thought it looked ugly, so I moved it up forward. And then Dracul tried to make this weird thing around it as it was still on the, the light here on the ground. And I hated it. So eventually, we came up with a compromise of it being on the ceiling above. And it actually looks pretty nice. I, I like it. All hail the gravity generator. <laughs> hail the almighty god. Oh, you kids and your toys. <laughs> so you told me to kill the infidels again. <laughs> Ah. Me. So, so ah. this is the cockpit. I designed this area. Here, I can give a full view of the ship now. Oh, Ludig, he's chasing me with the grinder. All right, kids, don't make me put you in timeout. <laughs> so originally, Wiseman and I started the build, and then Dracul jumped on, and he ended up helping out. Uh, we started with the tail section back. Oop, ah, stupid twitchy game. Uh, back here, and then we just moved forward and everything just kind of split and ended up this way. We had no idea what we were building. We literally started with one block that Wiseman placed and we just kind of went from there. Yeah. <laughs> so I'll show the other side real quick. Which the other side I predominantly decide, designed as well, which is where all the reactors are. We have cryopods and the med bay. It's also where the wheels are. What? Wheels? The wheels. Wheels. Yeah, the wheels. The wheels on the bus go round. <laughs> round. You don't remember the wheels? I don't remember the wheels. Better not be putting wheels on the ship. I didn't put wheels on the ship. You did it. <laughs> <laughs> that actually kind of looks interesting. <laughs> but yeah, this is uh, this is the Nautilus Explorer. The name of this particular ship is the Star Crescent, as why per Wiseman's way of naming ships. Mm-hmm. Because oh His Majesty's mighty ship sounds so cool. <laughs> so yeah, this is basically what we came up with. Now I'm sure eventually this will probably end up in the Glorious Adventures. And now that Wiseman's uh, DX11 is working, which, by the way, I'm sorry, there was a user that replied, and I don't remember which one it was, so I'm sorry I don't remember your name. I'll probably put it down at the bottom. But uh, we did fix, well, Wiseman did fix his DX11, DX11 issue. But thank you for your comment anyway. Yeah, it was a really weird solution. <laughs> okay, so next up is our skyscraper. So we built this actually before Planets came out. Uh, so that was a few months ago. And we still haven't quite finished it yet. But the story behind it was um, we were just in a room building one day. And I, I built a giant barge, which is in one of my previous shipyard episodes. And... Why, uh, Wiseman had a big ship, and I'm like, I need a big ship to move. So I grabbed it with the uh, with the barge and was able to move it, and it had lights going up the side of the ship. 
And we're, I was like, wow, that looks like a skyscraper. I was like, we should build a skyscraper. So we built a skyscraper. And here we are. Yep. yep. And the Dracul ended up uh, starting, I, I think. I think you started. This is this is my base, and then you you guys. <laughs> that, took over that's it, what it and was. I was. Yeah. Like, well, I'll just go add more on the top. <laughs> yeah. So, my compass tree thingies in the corners. Yep. So Dracul did. I would say, of the actual tower, he did. I would say about ninety percent of the design. With me coming in there, tweaking it here and there. I added like these support bars, the uh, the footing here at the bottom of the the base here. That's a fun fetish. <laughs> and I and and I had a compass, uh, a ma no, a maze, and a fountain in the middle, which yes. Nordic changed. Sorry. Well, okay. So his fountain was actual ice that would come down from a collector or a connector into a collector, and it made such a god awful clunking, clunk, clunk, thunking. Clunk, clunk, <laughs> clunk, 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 I mean, you could hear it from miles away or kilometers away. So I ended up putting in this hydrogen thruster. And now, it looks really cool. Yeah, I, I like how it turned out. I'm, I'm quite pleased. Nice little, you know, we, we can have a drink. Hey, this could yeah. be Lacarthian's place. <laughs> yeah, this could be the headquarters. I, I think if you do that, you need we need to either have it on a planet or a moon or something, or we have to build another... It has to be like, a little teeny asteroid where this thing just dwarfs it. <laughs> yeah. Yes, that is, that well, is brilliant. I, I actually did something like that. Uh, if you guys go through Salford Sal's videos, if you go back a while, I built them a hotel, the uh, Extended Relaxation Annex, uh, which I had to keep secret for a long time which upset me because it was such an awesome build. Like, I, I was afraid yep. I wouldn't be able to build it for them. And uh, Mir kept asking me, he's like, hey, did you build that yet? You know, he's like, I, I, I don't mean to bother you, but did you build it yet? And my original design was just terrible. And so I scrapped it one night and rebuilt the whole thing in one evening, and it was awesome. And it's this big building on a like a 500 meter wide spherical asteroid. And it just dwarfs the asteroid. So yeah, that's actually not a bad idea to kind of do something like that. So Th this this is a device we use to torture people when we are upset with them. Wait 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 wait. We'll get to that in a minute. Bear bear with me. Let's let's finish the skyscraper first, and then we'll show I, off. I your... was looking at Wiseman. Oh yeah, <laughs> the trees. <laughs> These are Wiseman's trees. He, he felt we needed decoration. Yeah. I I had intended to build a lion statue, which turned into a turtle. <laughs> it's actually, it's actually, a tree that doubles as a murder hole, so, yeah. <laughs> actually, if you have the uh, the turtle, you should spawn it in. Yeah, one second. Alright. So these down here are the hangers. I designed the hangers. Uh, None not of very big. Fit, ships fit at the time. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Okay, <laughs> so, turtle is here. Oh, oh, okay, yeah, let's see the turtle. <laughs> so yeah, that eventually became this, which I absolutely love the turtle design, which you did end up making into a big fish, right? Yep, I'll put that down too. <laughs> so Wiseman also decided to make walls around the perimeter here, and with the way he made it, I decided to add in uh, like a walkway through it with uh, with windows, and then I got yelled at because there was an extra window that had spawned in, and I'm like, there's no window, there, there's a window! Everybody yelled at me and I cried. <laughs> he really did cry, it was it was hilarious. Yeah. yeah. Why is so, the battle trout the upside down? Is over here. <laughs> the battle trout. There Dude, we go. Don't mind the battle trout, it's, it's not <laughs> my or anything. My remote control goldfish. Oh, this thing is awesome. Nordic got so mad because he kept bumping into him with it. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah, I remember that. Oh yeah, and then this is uh, Dracul's battle. <laughs> I forgot about this thing, and I actually do have a blueprint of it. That's awesome. So yeah. Oh, and then uh, I I also made like the arches slash walkway here. Yeah. See. Oh. So wait, last bit, last bit. So as we go up the tower, which most of it is empty, uh, we haven't gotten to finish building it. Is my yet. office still here? Yes, it is. That's what I'm getting to. Yeah, you, you, you want to get into your chair? Oh yeah, this is the room with the invisible chair. Uh, I, I might have to add in... <laughs> Wait, you gotta turn around. Oh, the chair's here now! <laughs> <laughs> I 
Yep, the, it, who's been messing with my chair? <sighs> He's not a very good emperor. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Look how it's nice and slow. It's so slow, too. <laughs> Whoop, whoa! <laughs> I wish you had a, I wish you had a cat on your lap right now. That would just complete the image. <laughs> All hail the god. <laughs> okay, so right here I'll edit in a picture that Wiseman took of me floating in that chair because he couldn't see the chair. To him I was just like hovering in a weird position. <laughs> so yes, this is our skyscraper, which eventually we're going to have to finish. Yeah, and and this room will contain many buttons that murder people. <laughs> yeah, murder buttons. Well, yeah, of course it's gonna have murder buttons. It's, it's my office. So, it's gonna have murder buttons. Nordic kind of made an unofficial rule that I'm not allowed to fly near him with with ships because I keep <laughs> crashing into stuff and bumping into him. I, I think the he only took him three tries to finish the hangers. <laughs> <laughs> well, the the only time I've ever gotten mad at you, to the point where I was like, fuck this, and I left, was because you kept slamming into me, you kept bouncing off of me. Okay, so today was the uh, the first cow slap initiative, right? The first one? Yeah. yeah. So I, I wasn't able to make it, I had to work today, so... Uh, and Dracul, you won it, right? Twice. Uh, Twice. Yeah. <laughs> but not because of skill or, or anything like that. <laughs> okay, so for... It, 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 the best part of the ship is the little deployable thingies that don't work because there's no gravity. Uh, some hot chick just told me there's an enemy detected. <laughs> yeah, 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 she did. She, she would, you know, she, she does that. That's her job. <laughs> All right, so the cow slap initiative... There you go. <laughs> okay, well, now it's attacking the station. All right, all right bear with me. Uh, the Cow Slap Initiative is basically Boris's new series of, uh, what was, what was the Weekend Madness? Wasn't that his original? Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's yeah, like the... the <laughs> oh, that is awesome. That is awesome. Mm -hmm. But anyway, uh, so yeah, it, Cow Slap Initiative is basically it cut a people... in the station and escaped. <laughs> I see. So it's basically... All right. Blah, blah. I no, 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 no. Anyway, uh, it's basically kind of a just like a group event every weekend or so of people just doing random crazy stuff and this week it was uh rovers and destruction derby yeah and this was the uh stay alive machine since apparently you didn't win you more or less stayed alive i well uh, don't get me wrong i kill people with it um and the best part of this thing is uh, are you are you looking are you watching are you looking, are you looking? I'm, I'm looking at you <laughs> this part <laughs> they took on like a bat out of fucking hell, and now you're going well, backwards. Hydrogen thrusters. Yeah. Well, yeah, I don't have any thrusters on this ship. There's, there's no, no. Oh crap! Wow. The other, the other thing is going to eat me. No! It's eating me. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. Um. Oh boy. All right. Well, since we've been building a lot of stuff lately, uh. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. This has ended oh, no. horribly, Dracul. Abandoned ship, abandoned ship. Oh. Never! <laughs> oh, you kids Goodbye. and your drugs. Goodbye. <laughs> yeah, well. a drug called oxygen. My people need me. Goodbye. <laughs> the pink shark people. You know what? Not all of them are pink. Okay, that, 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 take offense to that. That's that's racist. Oh, I'm 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 very sorry. Excuse me, Mike. <laughs> well, you know, you're, you're, the pink sharks are very very sensitive people. Okay, according to them, they have been repressed for about thousands of years. Repressed? They're se yes, repressed. sensitive people. Shark who've been repressed. Yes. All right. So anyway, for thousands of years. Since uh, now that uh, I've done a build with uh, with Wiseman here, and actually, and me and Dracul have done many, 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 many a builds, and then uh, the three of us actually did both of these contraptions. Uh, maybe somebody in the comments can suggest something for us to build in the future. Yeah! Something that involves more custom rockets, because that was cool! I have to admit, that was pretty sweet. <laughs> they didn't work that well in the contest, I will say. Yeah, we, 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 
broke physics and anything with wheels started floating in the air. <laughs> Actually, yes, you know what? that happened. We, um, because I've only put out one foundation episode, I should, um, uh, do another with you guys. Because, uh, you know, my foundation stuff is all about the physics of space engineers. And, like, in it I was testing hydrogen. That was the big thing about it at the time. But they haven't really implemented anything new into the game except for planets. And also, fucking cyber cyber dogs. Dogs. Th yeah, this yeah. needs to be a feature for this uh, this skyscraper. This needs to be a permanent feature Fuck. attached. You know what? Eat a dick. <laughs> Eat a big dick. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I, that fight was so epic. I died so quickly. <laughs> so I watched that. <laughs> yeah, if you guys go for those back. Those of you uh, that don't know. <laughs> go ahead. This particular scrappy little fighter, I was almost disheartened with it. I really was, because Nordic cut it in half by ramming it once, and the second time, he had the perfect shot that just went straight into the cockpit, and I was dead. But after that, he couldn't get that cockpit shot, so he couldn't hit me in the cock, and I killed him. <laughs> and it was with and this, this is what my ship looked like afterwards. Yep. Uh, also during the fight with him. I, he no. never hit me again after these couple <laughs> hits. So, the, the, this is the Vengeance. This is the fighter that I, I fought with him. And actually, if you go back to my episode, uh, I believe it was called The Dog Fight or Dog Fighting, something like that. Anyway, uh, I talk about it and I, I rant about it. Oh, yeah, 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 this was Wiseman's entry into yeah, it. the monolith. Yeah. And I... Uh, I was so happy when I built the Vengeance. Like, I, I, I still love the look of this thing. <laughs> And in that video, I go on a rant about this. I'm, I put this out, I'm like, and he won! He won! <laughs> <laughs> but I, I have to admit, I, I do love the Ares. That is one of my favorite ships that you have ever built. Uh, it's, oh, it's so gorgeous. Yeah, the monolith broke so many times <laughs> because one rocket shot to the underside of the cockpit, the nose piece, and all my reactors went away. And I couldn't do anything. Okay, last thing I'll oh. show, uh, just to kind of go with the monolith. Uh, Wiseman knows what I'm going to paste in. I think. What? Oh, yeah, the Nordolith. The Nordolith. So. The precursor <laughs> atmosphere. <laughs> but atmosphere it's not precursor atmosphere. Precursor the monolith. All right, so basically what happened was is I, I actually like the monolith. I, I, I find it a very interesting ship. So I parked one and started to build it from the ground up, and I came up with what I call the Nordolith. And I'm very happy that uh, Wiseman actually liked it, so... Yeah. I think it's, <laughs> it was the also. trans atmospheric version that was the precursor to the monolith. <laughs> this is where I For describe. those of you that remember the sound wave, you may notice I have rebuilt a razor beak. Which I believe... Means the sound wave is coming. Well, well hold on. Uh, I believe it was my shipyard episode, I want to say five. It, it's named as This Halloween. And I reviewed his ship, actually, the Sound Wave and the, uh, the Razor Beak. So this is his vanilla Razor Beak. So the... Which is much bigger and meaner than the original Razor Beak. <laughs> this is very true. The original Razor Beak had no weapons. Except for it looked, I remember it looked like an electric shaver. Because I was like, hey, that a looks bit, like a yeah. razor. <laughs> oh, Nordic. Oh, what? What? You should show them the wise men. Okay, okay. Yes. That'll be the last yes. thing I spawn in. <laughs> As before says, the, as this is getting to be like. <laughs> <laughs> right, yes, right. guys, we're, we're going to make you sit through a four hour episode of us pasting every ship we own. Yeah. So I, I, I designed this last night. Uh, me and Dracul were. After uh, after Wiseman went to bed, Dracul and I were sitting there making drones, and I put that upside down. Let's try this again. Yeah, so we were sitting there making drones, and Dracul would make a drone, and I'd be like, hey, that's a good idea, and make something else. And then I remembered something I had made a long time ago, which was a super tiny drone, which was similar to this. Uh, it was designed to use just a connector to connect to a fighter, and then... Uh, you could fly the fighter around and then disconnect it and I ended up building this and Dracul said I should name it the Wiseman because for the Glorious Adventure series we're talking about Wiseman using something like this at some point without giving them too much away so mm -hmm. I ended up naming it the Wiseman and it is the most adorable little yeah. utility drone <laughs> he showed me and I, I kind of got that you know reaction of when you see a cute puppy 
I will show you what I think of your cuteness. Hey, get out of here. Jerk. <laughs> get back here. No. No, no, no. Ow. My face. As you <laughs> my, my nose. I broke my nose. My wall was useful. I can't Did see he? where I'm going. I broke ah. the camera. <laughs> I wish this I'm was blind. the one. I wish this was I'm the blind. one. Oh! Hi. Hello. Anybody there? I'm blind. Nope. There's no one. Ah! Oh, jeez. Okay. Can um, I get him? Alright, I think I'm gonna, him? End the, I'm gonna end the episode here. Yeah, very not the episode. <laughs> sure. ah. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, hit that like button. I'll see you guys next time. Bye! So, your coolest thing is still floating away from the station. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it, it ground through. Hold on, let me go. Okay, so, yeah, if you look, I think it's, yeah, it's right there. It ground through the station there, and it's still floating. <laughs> look at that. It's still going. Okay, it's four, 14 kilometers out. <laughs> <laughs> Already? Yep.